Wagwan Wagwan Welcome to the Kickoff FC show It's your boy Dan Rumba Right 2012 is on location So not to watch no face The show must go on The show goes on You see me I say I'm recovering from a little flu From last week That's why you only see alright uh, Before And now it's my turn to hold down the fort, you see what I say? So now we have the cup tie against Sevilla. You see it? Welcome back Casemiro from the red card incident. We definitely, definitely gonna need you to hold down the fort against these boys. Cause you know Spanish opponents, they come zinging and zagging down the line and they come in for blood. We can't let these boys get over on us. We have to step on them foot. Step on them chest. Kick down to three night, isn't it? So this game, I'm really looking forward to see how the team morale shines through without Rashford in the lineup. Who is going to step up and give us goals and those runs in behind the defense? Because you know Rashford doesn't stand still. He doesn't come short for the ball at all. He definitely looks over the top. Always trying to get beyond the defense. To get a one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. So I'm curious to see how Sancho fits in against Sevilla. On this cup tie. Hopefully Marshall can keep his goal scoring going. And not get injured again. He's, he's becoming like Anthony Davis now, Mr. Street Clothes. But we now wish that funny tongues, isn't it? So, Anthony, Marshall, and Sancho leading the line for us. I just need these dudes to give us their best performance and hold down the fort for Rashford and Erickson coming back as well from injury. So we're not going to Rush him into the starting lineup. I'm, I'm, I love that. The gaffer is just putting him on the bench. Let him see the pace of the flow. Bringing him on for a few minutes here and there. Just so he can get more acclimated. And get back to form. So that we have our three-headed monster in the midfield. Which is Hernandez, Erickson, and the boss from Brasileiro. You know what I mean, I say, Casemiro. The man so wicked that you see that he was sorely missed. He was so missed in the midfield of the park where we had to try so many different coordinations and different player formations and set up in the midfield. We can't have that. You see me? Man, them talk about Fred. Who? For start and so sitting. No. No. I love that the boss actually brings some of his Scotland farm into the last game. And score a goal for us. Make sure that we got the victory. You see, McTominay, we're going to need you today again. He's playing his best football yet. And I saw a report that asked, is McTominay's best even good enough to start in the midfield for Manchester United? That's the question that I want y'all to answer in the comments. Is McTominay's best even good enough to start when we have the full assortment of players? Ericsson healthy, Casemiro not on a red card, Garnacho available. You know? And who knows? We might get Drew Bellingham next season. We might get somebody from Bayern Munich. I heard they got a scuffle when they lost the City recently. So there's a lot of opportunities leading up to the end of the season for everybody to stake their claim for the midfield position and starting positions all around the field. I hope, I hope, I pray that... One Basaka can keep his position because I don't, me personally, don't have confidence in the load. 
I mean, no. It, it's, nah. Mm-mm. One Masaka is the energy god for me. You see me? Even though his touch technically might not be as great as Delu, but what he brings to the table gives me more security than Delu. Because certainly if you put Delu and, and Maguire next to each other, the right side is definitely leaking. We're not getting a clean sheet there. No way, no how, no sir. No way, no how, no sir. You know what I'm saying? The head gonna be making five saves, and also he gonna let in one or two goals. So Genoa, Sevilla. My predictions for this game is um, we go. It's gonna be a, a nail biter. I'm going two one. You see me? Because it's gonna be difficult. To come by goals without Rashford. Because he's been bagging them in for the whole season. I doubt anybody else even have 10 goals on the squad. You know? And he's ripping it down every other game he's scoring. So, 2-1. Not a comfortable victory. I'm looking for a Fergie time goal. Hopefully, Marshall or one of the subs can come on and change the game and give us some greatness. You know? I'm really looking forward to this game. You see, I got my fit on from early. You see me? You don't know I think go. Thank you for tuning in. This is the Kickoff FC show. I'm your boy, Don Rumba. Make sure to like and subscribe. See y'all on the flip side. We out.